Hey, how's it going, everybody? Welcome back to another episode here of the Terraria Let's Play. Thank you, as always, for all of your lovely support throughout the series, my friends. I very much do appreciate it. Of course, if you want to continue supporting the series, the best and easiest way to do so is simply to drop a like. But, of course, if you want to go one further, use code Python when ordering any sneak energy drinks or to get 5% off any of my Apex gaming PCs. In the last episode, of course, we went ahead and we smoothed out the entire right-hand side of the world and sort of started to restore the natural beauty of the Terraria world world by placing down trees and various other bits and bobs. Of course, we have the left-hand side of the world to go ahead and smooth out as well, but as a matter of fact, what we're going to be doing is taking a little bit of a break from Project Overhaul, because today, I want to go ahead and sort of catch ourselves up with our Master Mode exclusive drop collection, my friends. In that over here, you may notice that we still do not have the Queen Slime Master Mode drop. We also, of course, don't have ourselves the Brain of Cthulhu Master Mode drop. But that's mostly because we don't have the resources to make ourselves any uh, Brain of Cthulhu summons. So, yeah. Alright, so we're going to need ourselves a bunch of the gelatin crystals. And I guess if we manage to get ourselves the resources necessary to make ourselves a... Was it a bloody spine, I think? Then, yeah, we could always go at it that way. In terms of taking out the Brain of Cthulhu, that is. Uh, do we have any vertebrae? Yeah, we've got one. We're going to need way more than that, my friendos. We may need to make ourselves a crimson biome in today's episode. The only thing is, I don't know where I want to be doing that. I really, really don't. I don't think any of the right-hand side of the world is a decent area to make ourselves a crimson biome. If I'm going to make a crimson biome, I feel like I should go ahead and overhaul this corruption biome because then I feel like we'd be prepared, you know? We'd be able to take down the Brenda Cthulhu at the surface. We'd have ourselves a whole bunch of surface area for the crimson as well to have ourselves a bunch of crimson trees and vicious mushrooms and all that kind of stuff, you know? So... Hmm, maybe today's the day we make ourselves a proper crimson as well. We've got 14 vicious powder, which I guess is pretty cool. But the thing is, I'm pretty sure we've actually got way more than that. Maybe in our generic chest? Uh, we've got vile mushrooms. I could have sworn that we had more than just 14 vicious powder. Oh, there we are. Yeah, 60 further vicious powder. All right, we're going to be able to make ourselves a pretty decently sized crimson biome here, my friends. This is great. All right, all we need to do is grab ourselves some blocks that cannot be overcome with any evil. Uh, I usually like to use snow bricks, so let's go ahead and continue on with that. And uh, yeah, we're going to make ourselves a custom crimson biome. If we manage to get both Master Mode drops for both the Queen Slime and Brain of Cthulhu today, then I'd probably feel way better about going ahead and actually progressing through the game again, you know, getting ourselves some mech boss is taking out the game, you know? I think that'd be a nice way to go, my friends. We have basically only gotten as far as Queen Slime, the first of the hard mode bosses, so yeah, maybe it's time we start progressing again. Needless to say, we are gonna go ahead and have this lake here be crimsonified. I thought that'd be a good idea. So uh, yeah, let's do a little bit of uh, custom terraforming, and we'll see what happens. Oh, another Nimbus Rod opportunity! And I die. Okay, I got impaled by the rain. <laughs> well, that's a death message I don't think I've seen before. <laughs> anyway, quick progress update. Just to say that, yeah, I might have begun on uh, smoothing out this area. But it's only this area that I'm smoothing out at this particular moment. I'm not spending an entire another episode doing this, my friends. Don't worry. Oh, fuck. Mm -hmm. Goodness sake, man. I was about to go ahead and kill this nimble... Uh, okay. That'll do quite nicely as well. Thanks, Falling Star. <laughs> hey, guys, you know what they say about the stars aligning for you? Well, the stars are falling for me right now. <laughs> yep, another death. I never thought that building in Terraria could be such a pain in the butt, dude. At least the good news is we keep going past the uh, desert structure house so I can go ahead and just sort of heal myself here. <laughs> Alrighty, guys. I think I've got the section I want to make into a crimson all set out nicely and all smoothed out nicely as well. We've got this big old lake here, which we can do crimson fishing at, and it lasts all the way until we get to this uh, little dip here, at which point it turns into a corruption. So, ladies and gentlemen, the question is this. Can you just go ahead and do this? 
Yes, you can. <laughs> Easy transformation into the Crimson, ladies and gents. And of course, to speed things along, you can use the Staff of Regrowth to plant grass down on dirt. So that uh, certainly makes things a bit easier as well, doesn't it? All right, let's see if we can do this real quick. Turn this lake into crimson. There we have it, my friends. All right, we now have enough of the crimson here to start spawning in mobs, which is beautiful. We've got crim slimes, we've got face monsters, and all those kinds of butt-headed dudes. And uh, yeah, as a result, we should start to get ourselves a supply of vertebrae, which is exactly what we are needing. Yeah. Oh, oh, for goodness sake. Do you know what we're not needing? Those stupid herplings. Ah! Ah! More herpling deaths. Dude, honestly, the death count has begun absolutely nuts these last couple of episodes. All because all I'm trying to do is smooth out my freaking world. All right, there we are. We have ourselves a bunch of trees placed down. And uh, hopefully over time, they'll all grow up. And this crimson biome will look like it's, you know, always been here, I guess. Now, I must admit, I can't actually remember just how many vertebrae we need for a bloody spine. I have a feeling it might be 15. I could be wrong, though. But I think it's 15. All righty, my friend. Time to spice things up a bit. We've got some water candles and we have a battle potion. All right, fellas, come on, do your best. All righty, guys. Well, I feel like we've done enough of the beautiful farming stuff. So we've got uh, 16 vertebrae here. I'm pretty sure it's 15, right? Pretty sure, because it's basically the crimson counterpart of the worm food. And the worm food only takes 15 uh, corrupted parts, whatever they're called. So, uh, yeah, let's get ourselves down to a demon altar, wherever the nearest one is. I honestly can't remember. And, uh, yeah, let's uh, get this thing on the way. Ah, there it is, my friends, the bloody spine. It appears to have a different sprite in 1.4 compared to my uh, Calamity Let's Play. So that's pretty awesome. It's a pretty cool looking sprite, actually. Nice. And now, ladies and gentlemen, for the first time in this series and only on episode, what is this, 27? We are going to take down the Brain of Cthulhu for the first time. If we get ourselves the Master Mode drop first time, I'm going to be in incredibly happy, actually. Uh, the only thing is, I, I don't think, I can't use it because this isn't technically a crimson biome. I need more crimson stuff around here, guys. Maybe if I just sort of laid down a whole bunch of crimstone blocks, that might do the job. At the end of the day, I think this area is always going to be probably one of the most dangerous areas in this entire map. Because, of course, we have both crimson and corruption dudes spawning in the same biome area. So something we need to be very careful of, my friends. When it comes to future sessions of farming, we got to be careful. So, uh, yeah, let's start going ahead and uh, spreading in some crimstone here. Uh, I don't really know just how much I'm going to need to put down. Hopefully not overly much. Oh, God. Uh, guys, the corruption is now starting to spread into the desert here. Uh-oh. That's actually really bad, because that means this entire desert is going to be evilified in not too long an amount of time, I imagine. That's not good at all, is it? Well, according to the background music, this is still a corruption biome, would you believe? This is insane, man. Can I not use this thing now? Oh, no, I can. Okay. Uh, right. Crimson Brain of Cthulhu dude time. Hey, buddy. Right, time to kick some booty, I think. There we are. Come on. Come on. I mean, it's only Master Mode Brain of Cthulhu. It's not that difficult, is it? Come on. All right. And there we have it. He's doing his weird thing where I can barely tell which one is him. Oh, he's dead. Huh. That was easy. All right. Well, uh, that'll do it. Oh, my goodness me. We actually did get it first time. Wow. <laughs> Oh, oh, bro, okay. That's just made all of the deaths more than worth it, guys. Wow. We actually got it first time. <laughs> oh, that is so pog, dude. Absolutely fantastic. All right, so, uh, yeah, with that goal done, we can now shift our focus onto the queen slime, which, of course, is going to be the more difficult thing to farm out, but um, still, we might get some unique stuff that we haven't gotten before, you know? You never know. But, uh, yeah, at the end of the day, we actually have ourselves the final of the pre-hard mode master mode exclusive drops, and I tell you what, my friends, it feels good, baby. <laughs> oh, yes, it does. There it is. Opening up the treasure bag, of course, we do have ourselves a brain of confusion, which is actually 
not a bad idea for the Queen Slime boss. What do you guys think, eh? Do we have it in place of the Magiluminescence? That is the question. I don't know. To have a chance of entirely dodging damage, I mean, you never know. The only thing we have to deal with, of course, is the lack of acceleration in our movement speed here. But, you know, we could just dash to get our speed going pretty quick. I don't think we need to worry too much about it, my friends. So, yeah, pretty cool stuff. So then, gelatin crystal time, my friends. I'm going to go get myself three. I think three might be a good amount of chances to uh, get ourselves the Master Mode exclusive drop. So, uh, yeah. Three gelatin crystals coming up. Oh, one already, my friends. There we have it. All right, where's number two? Oh, hallowed mimic time, is it? All right, all right. Come on, then. See what you can do there, son. See what you can do. Probably going to die again, if I'm being entirely honest. But you never know. Weirder things have happened, right? Yep, there we are. Told you. Ah. I'm getting kind of tired of dying now. Oh, there's number two, my friends. We just need one more, ideally. And then I feel good about my chances of getting a Master Mode drop. I feel like we should have had it by now. But uh, you know how Terraria can be sometimes, eh? And there, ladies and gentlemen, is number three. All right, let's get some buffs on us and let's take down Queen Slime. We are going to get the Master Mode drop, right? Terraria, you're going to give it to me, yeah? You may have noticed already that I've got my ammo set up in such a way that we maximize our damage. We've got I-Core to reduce the defense of Queen Slime, and then, of course, the Holy Arrows to absolutely pummel the poop out of her. So, uh, yeah, I think we should have this in the bag. I certainly hope so, anyway. I mean, we have taken a damn many times already, so, uh, you know, I am just hope that I can continue on with that theme, you know? Well, I say theme. I've rather died a lot today, so maybe we could kill something else in return a whole bunch so how's about we use ourselves the ammo box and then we get ourselves some buff potions and then we'll be golden yep seems like a pretty good set of buffs here my friends are we even going to have space for all of them that is the question uh is there anything i can actually get rid of here maybe chester here i can get rid of him the shadow orb as well uh that should hopefully free up enough yeah all right let's buff on up oh my goodness me <laughs> Wow! All right, come on then, Queenie. Let's do this thing, Queenie. Where you at, Queenie? There you are. Come on then. And ladies and gentlemen, go on, that's right. You do your little sort of landing thing. Uh, oh, no, never mind. She's dead. Huh. Oh, Lizzie. Barely took any damage at all, actually. Huh. All right, did we get anything? Nope. Nothing that time. Did we get anything out of the treasure bag? The blade staff again. Um, sure. All right, well, uh, number two. Come on, we want to get this Master Mode drop. Come on, Terraria. All right, no delays. Back to it. Queenie, where you at? There you are. Oh, no, there she is. <laughs> come on, then, lassie. Let's see what you can do, eh? Come on, come on. Well, I say see what you can do. I want to see what I can do. I want to absolutely pummel you into the ground because you deserve it. The amount of times you killed me earlier in the series is ridiculous. So, yeah, it's about time that I got some uh, nice revenge here. Already almost a halfway point here, guys, which is kind of nice. Okay, make that present tense. We are in second phase already. Yeah, baby. A little bit of I-Core being done there. I'm sure you guys just saw that. Yeah. All right, so far, so good. So far, so good. That's right. You do your landing thing. Then that's when we do the most amount of damage is when she lands like that. You see that? How far kind of takes a bit of a dive when she goes ahead and, uh, well, dives. So, yeah. All right, come on. Come on. Come on, lassie. You're gone, da. There we are. Come on. Give me the drop. Did we get it? No, we didn't. Of course we didn't. That would mean being lucky. Oh, my gosh. All right, we got one more attempt here. Come on, Terraria. What is wrong with you? It is a 25 percent drop chance that isn't even uncommon that's incredibly common man oh my word i'm actually i'm in disbelief as to how unlucky i'm being here come on i really do feel like we've got another plantera for my old drunk master mode series you guys remember that wait was it that series that i had it i had massive problems with plantera in terms of getting the master mode drop and uh yeah i feel like we're heading for a similar situation here uh oh our high-end buffs are kind of uh, running out oh well come on one more time, Queenie. One more time. No! This is so close. Oh! Oh, she's dead. Oh! I didn't see a Master Mode drop. 
I didn't see a master mode drop, and there wasn't. <laughs> I hate this game sometimes. I really, really, really hate this game sometimes. Oh, oh yeah, right, and uh, goodbye 33 gold coins as well. All right, one more batch of queen slimes, and then I'm pretty much done for the episode, okay? If I don't manage to get it in the next batch of queen slimes, then I am going to give up for today's episode, and then we shall come back in another episode and just beat the living poop out of her. Because, uh, yeah, I'm getting kind of tired of this grind now for the master mode drop. We've been at it for a while now, and we just haven't had it. It's just a bunch of poo, if you ask me. Oh, Terraria, Terraria, you're really starting to get on my nerves now. There's one gelatin crystal. All right, there's a second gelatin crystal, and would you believe there's actually a third one right next to it? That's actually kind of awesome. <laughs> Certainly one of the luckier things that have happened in today's episode. All right, the last three queen slimes were taken down in today's episode. If we manage to get what we're looking for, amazing. If not, then I'm going to just flat out just leave. <laughs> There's a time and a place for everything in the world, my friends, and if today isn't the day or time to get ourselves the master mode drop, then I guess we just have to kind of accept that and come back and try and get it another time, eh? Alrighty, my friends, the time of messing around has ended. Let's just do this thing, shall we? Let's get this thing done. Come on, Queenie, let's kick some booty! Alright, there goes another Queenie. Wait, 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 wait. We got something. Hey, a Queen Slime trophy. You know what? I actually don't think I've ever seen that before. That's pretty cool. Anyways, straight on to the next one. No sign of a Master Mode drop. Come on! Let's go, man! Let's go! We finally got the bloody thing! Ha! Oh. <laughs> We finally got it, ladies and gentlemen. Finally. Goal complete. 